guys, so I think I'm ready to play some episode today. You heard me right. We are going to play episode. And if you don't know what episode is, we are on the same page. All right, guys, I'm ready to get started. Are you? Okay, good. Welcome. We can't wait for you to start your first story. Welcome to Episode, a collection of interactive stories. Oh my gosh, this is so official. Use the left and right arrow. Oh my gosh, we're gonna choose a story. Okay. Use the left and right arrows to choose a story. A hot friend comes to stay at your house while your dad is away. Too bad that a romance between the two of you is against the rules. I want to play as a girl. I want the main love interest to be a guy. Episode one, the rule breaker. Let's get this started. What's your first name? What about like Madison? We'll put Madison. Choose a look. Oh my gosh, we get to customize it. This is what I really wanted to do. Okay, I think we're looking pretty cute. So we're just gonna press done. You look awesome. I know. Guys, I'm having a party tonight at my place. Cool, I'll be there. You'll be there too, right babe? Of course. Cool, be right back. Gotta take a dump. What the? God, Russ is just so amazing. Watch it, that's my boyfriend you're talking about. I was just making a joke, relax. It wasn't very funny. You tell her. I didn't know you guys were official. We are. That's so great, I'm so happy for you. Not. Keep an eye on her. What? I didn't say anything. Yo, what is up with the sass in this game? I don't like it. So, Madison, I heard you'll be parents free for a month. Yeah, my dad is leaving on a business trip early tomorrow. That means you'll throw some awesome parties, right? Madison! Madison! If you throw some parties, I'll be mad at you, okay? Uh, I haven't thought about that. Um, you shouldn't ever think about it. You should have a wild party. If she doesn't want to have a wild party, she doesn't have to. Whatever. I should get home. My phone died and I don't want my dad to worry. I get you. I'll see you later tonight. Of course. Where are you going, baby girl? I'm leaving. Do you mind taking me home? Uh, right now? Yeah. Boy, what? Yo, but what's your problem? I don't like the attitude. The, the energy is really bad in here right now. There you are. Oh, who's this old man? This old man is her dad. And you are? Dad, this is Russ, my boyfriend. What's up, brother from another mother? You're dating this loser? You better be out of my house in three seconds or else. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Rude. I thought you said your dad was cool, Madison. Whatever, I'm out of here. Sorry, dad, my phone died. Did you tell me something important? As a matter of... What is up with this ringer? As a matter of fact, yes. I want to talk to you about my business trip tomorrow. Dad, I'll be fine. It's just a month. I can take care of myself. Not. I know something's gonna go wrong. I know you can. Dot, dot dot i have a friend who just got out of a relationship and needs a place to stay while he finds a new one i told him he can stay here if that's okay with you you want me to live with someone i've never met you have met him but you were much younger then so i'm not sure if you remember him i don't need a babysitter i'm going to college soon it's a favor to him he needs a place to stay i wouldn't leave you here with someone random trust me easton is an angel easton yes easton king ring any bells Easton king yeah i remember him well he's coming over tonight guys if you keep on seeing the ringer the ringer pop up i am so freaking sorry something's wrong with this phone it's a really old phone what i thought we could all have dinner together so you could get to know each other better i have plans with russ tonight no you don't <laughs> not anymore hey i have an idea why don't i come with you absolutely not but amari gets to go are you guys talking behind my back never babe Oh my gosh, they're dating! Madison wants to come with us on my business trip. Ah! What's so funny? Sweetheart, you have school. You just want to be alone together. That is absolutely right. Well, that too. Now go freshen up. Easton will be here any second. I'm so annoyed with this ringer. It's getting really annoying. I'm gonna go home and pack my bags. I'll see you tomorrow. Whoa. So they're doing some talking. Oh, is that Easton? Maybe that's Easton. Whoa. So Madison is looking cute. Madison, this is Easton. Oh my God. I can't wait to see Easton. Oh my gosh. You see my face? This man standing before me was nothing like how I've imagined. Sorry. I'm drooling a little bit. Sorry about I'm drooling a little bit too much. Two seconds later. Sorry, I'm drooling. He had skin that was smooth like velvet. Soft but captivating. 
He was the most gorgeous man I've ever seen. Yeah. Girl, shut up! Customize. Oh, I could customize him. Oh, wow. Um, this one right here, chestnut brown. I like that one. I think this is all good. I think he's. This is perfect. Is this your daughter? Yeah. I didn't realize she'd be so so. Ethan paused for a moment. It seemed like he was looking for the right word. Pizza what? Nothing. Is something burning? The pizza! Are you done staring? Sorry, it's just been such a long time since I've seen you. It has been quite some time. It's great to see you again. Um, yeah. How old are you? I'm 24. And you must be? I'm 18. Huh? What? Sorry, it's kind of weird to see that you're almost an adult now. What do you mean almost? I'm already an adult. I am an adult. Sure you are. I do stuff that adults do. Chill the heck down. Take it. 10 notches down, okay? Oh, really? Yes. Yes. Like what? Uh... Yeah, that's what I thought. Dinner is ready! After you. Oh, that was cute. Oh, so I- Okay, so I'm not having it. The pizza you've made is amazing. I haven't had a home-cooked meal in ages. Tina didn't cook for you? Sorry for bringing your ex up. I didn't think. It's fine. She was always too tired or out partying with her friends, and I can't cook to save my life. Madison is excited in the kitchen. I bet she could cook you something nice while I'm away. Right, sweetie? Uh, I forgot that this game, like, had options. You know what? I think I'm gonna be a rude person in today's game. Why should I? I don't even know him. Madison, you're being rude. You know what? We started the game off with a bad attitude. Why don't we finish the game off with a bad attitude? It's fine. Don't worry. So, what happened to you and your girlfriend? Madison? <clears throat> we broke up because she cheated on me with my best friend. So, I'm currently looking for an apartment since we were living together. It's not easy to find a nice apartment with a great location in this town. No, you could stay here as long as you'd like. Okay, James, I get you're being nice, but you're being a little too nice and over excessive. You're being a little excessive here. I appreciate that, James. I'd like it more if you let me pay you. Looking after my daughter while I'm away is more than enough. She can be a handful. Oh, really? He's exaggerating. It looks like I'll be the judge of that. Uh, I don't like him. Russ. Hey, babe, where are you? Oh, no. I forgot to tell Russ I can't go to his party. May I please be excused for a minute? Hey, I'm sorry, but I can't come tonight. I'm having dinner with my dad and his friend. You're kidding me, right? Can't you sneak out later? Can't. You can't or you won't. I'll try to sneak out later, okay? Are you being peer pressured, Madison? That's not what we do. No, you won't. <gasps> Oh, I hate this. Excuse me? You're not sneaking out later. You can't tell me what to do. Fine, let's get your dad then. Wait! Yes. Maybe we can negotiate? Negotiate, huh? Yes. This should be interesting. Go on. If you don't tell my dad what I'm up to, then I won't tell him what you're up to. Does she know something that we don't? What am I up to? Come on. I bet you'd like to party and have some fun instead of babysitting me. Let's get something clear, okay? Your dad is a very good friend of mine. I'm in the middle of a separation, and he's kind enough to open his home for me in exchange for keeping an eye on you. Now, what kind of friend would I be if I let him down like that? Right, Matt? Madison? Who are you meeting anyway? I think I should be honest. My date. You have a date? Yes, I do. And we are so in love. Well, tell your lover that you're staying in tonight. You should know that while your dad isn't here, you'll be living under my rules. There will be no sneaking out at night or acting reckless. Whoa, who do you think you are? There you are. Is everything okay? Yeah. Totally fine. I was telling your daughter that she'll be following my rules while you're away. Good! I trust you to take care of her. Oh, I will. I don't like this, dude. Oh my goodness! I haven't shown you to your room yet! Madison, would you be an angel and show him to the guest room? Of course. This is your room. Thanks, little one. <sighs> Sorry, I used to call you that when you were younger. But I guess you're not so little anymore. No, I'm not. So don't call me that again. Fully noted. Good. You know, it wouldn't hurt you to be a little nicer to me. Yes, it would. Oh my- <laughs> I love myself. You know, you used to love me when you were younger. I gave you your favorite 
doll when you were younger, remember? You played with it for months. I was a kid back then. It's going to take me more than a toy to get me to like you now. I have a feeling it's going to be interesting to live with you. More like torture. If we're done here, I'd like to leave. I'll check on you later tonight. Relax, I won't sneak out. God, he's already getting on my nerves. Up. Relax, 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 take a chill pill. Relax, he'll only be here for a few weeks. Watch it turn into a month. <sighs> Who's this dude with the hairdo? Hello, who are you? Hi, I'm Tawny Easton's assistant. He has an assistant? Oh, you poor thing. I actually enjoy working for him. He's a good man. Right. It's okay, you can lie to me. I know he could be broody, but he hasn't had it easy in his life. Thank God for your dad. Without him, I'm not sure what would have happened to him. What do you mean by that? You don't know the story of how they met? Um, no. Your dad basically saved his life. The story is really emotional. I almost burst into tears every time I tell the story. <sighs> I'd love to tell you about it, if you have time. I'm really curious to know the story and learn why Easton is the way he is. Let's understand Easton. I have time. I'd love to hear the story. All right. The story begins 11 years ago. Dun, dun, dun. If you guys want to find out why Easton is the way he is, and if you want to continue my episode journey with me, please stay tuned for the next episode. And I want to start giving shout outs again on my video. So the first person to comment down below the popcorn emoji will get a special shout out in my next video. If you haven't subscribed already, please do and make sure you turn on the notification bell to get notified every time I post a new video. I love you all so much, 659 subscribers. I am thankful for all of you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go. I'll see you next time. Bye!